what's up guys in this video i will show you how to model a more complex shape type of roof using the add profile x-ray and the add edge of massing inside okay or in massing inside okay in this project i use the architectural template okay before we start this tutorial i would like to ask to everyone that please view every part of this video and please don't forget to like share or subscribe so everyone updated once i make a video tutorial like this okay so now what i'm going to do is to set the units first to this project and i set this into meters and rp for the reference line shortcut okay and control shift to copy and set this into 30 okay so this i rename this into one and this is two okay and rp again i want this guide here the reference okay so now i just go to site to set all of this okay so i set this into four meters and pick this right click to your mouse create similar and use the pick and set it into four and three four five six seven eight and nine or ten so this is ten floors okay so now i just go to massing inside okay pick this and in place mass okay and i just draw a rectangle from but before we do the angle, you choose first the reference plane one, okay? And draw a rectangle here, and I set this into, let's say, 17 meters. Okay? MB to move this in the reference line, like this, okay? And again, rectangle and now you choose the reference plane one for two and i just simply draw a rectangle like this okay now if you go to 3d he look like this okay for example this is firewall and here in this side is firewall example okay hold the control shape okay and create form solid form okay i make this kind of shape because i want to show you how to make a very smooth roof using this ad profile okay so hit the tab to select all like this and now I use the edge for this one, okay? So I place uh, one here, okay, and also one here, okay, and hit the top again, okay, and now I just use the add profile. So I just place one here, one here, okay, add profile. like this okay so if you rotate this you look like this okay so this is in the, the rope shape now okay so what i'm going to do next is to hit the tab like this and i choose the x-ray 
Okay, the X-ray you can see all the point element inside. Okay, so it's better. I just move it this one like this. Okay, because this is the smooth rope, so I need to draw like this. Okay. So this is the shape already. Okay. And now I just simply pick this and I just drag it little bit like this. Okay. So once you have this, okay. Hit the tab and uncheck the x-ray and delete this all. So if I will change this into realistic and fine, you see, you get the very smooth design, okay, to your project. For example, this is the firewall. Firewall is, this is the front only, okay. So now, once you have this, okay, hit finish, okay. So now go to massing inside and go to rope. Of course, rope. Okay, and I just change this into page in the bottom. Okay, and edit type, duplicate, and let's say this is rope. Okay, and I just edit this and set this into point five. Okay, hit okay and pick this and create the rope. So you have already a rope there. Okay, so you can pick this, okay, and edit and change the material. For now, let's say gypsum board. I like this so white of gypsum board. Okay. So now go to reference level, okay. Architecture. Floor, okay, and use the pick, okay, and hit finish. Okay, if you go to 3D like this, so this is what it looks already, okay. So now I just go again into massing inside, okay, and use the wall. Okay, edit type, duplicate, wall. Okay, and of course you need to change this into white and pick this. Also this one. Okay, so now you see this is the shape of the rope. Okay, so now I just go to wall again and I just simply pick this, okay, and also in this side. Okay, and I just simply pick this two, and I just change this into a store brand. and join element. Okay, so 
you can see the almost the same to Saha Hadid rope shape. Okay, that is the procedure how to make a complex shape using the add uh, profile x ray and the add edge. Okay, so now you can modify it also this by picking this okay and you can drag it little bit one meter like this okay it's up to you so you see it's more uh, look better okay So now, you can add all, whatever you want here, the door, everything, to your project. Okay. So now what I'm going to do next, if you want to make a floor for this one, you just simply pick this and simply hide the element. Okay. And pick the mass. Okay. And mass floor hold the control shift release check all the box okay and go to floor window it like this and create a floor and now you can hide this and hide the element or the install front so you have automatically a floor like this okay so that is the very quick procedure how to make a complex shape uh, rope in the building design if you want okay and you can add it also the 3d but before you place a text there you need to go to set okay and pick a plane and make sure that you snap here okay before you place a text there okay so you can modify it like this the the height okay the text size will be 0.1 okay let's see of or one meter okay one meter and you can double click it to for example you rename it into north eastern college okay And now you can pick this and you can drag it here, okay. It's not too easy because if we will see in the 3D, okay, if we will see the angle is like this, okay. If we go to level 1 or site, The angle is in this kind in this direction okay so now i hope that it's very clear how to make a complex complex shape of rope okay with the different angle of building okay so that is the procedure you can follow that one and you can add it also the door here okay by using the uh, door family that existing in this into your rabbit okay the store plant uh, door okay so Yeah.
and if you want to modify this okay just double click this and drag it like this okay so it's more uh, clear okay and to make sure that uh, that is attached okay pick this and attach to the top base okay so it's more uh, clear and also here you need to double click this and go to this okay and you can drag it also this like this remove constraint okay and hit finish so now if we go to 3d okay this is already what exactly no okay so i hope that everyone can follow the procedure please don't forget to like share or subscribe to this channel so so it's helped me out a lot especially everyone updated once i make a video tutorial like this okay so this is the south and i can render it because i this is long time to render so i just re render into the basic one and i just put in the beginning of this video so thank you to all of you see you in my next video